welcome back scorpio hope you guys are doing well we're obviously gonna just jump right in so this is gonna be for scorpio scorpio this is for you for the month of february what is coming towards scorpio could be another water sign cancer pisces scorpio masculine for scorpio Any This is for you. For Scorpio. Okay, so overall energy, Eight of Swords. So there could be um, somebody that is very in their head about a decision that has to be made. Oh, wow. Some of you guys could be experiencing a tower. Some of you guys could have withdrew from a situation as well. Looks like something could be weighing heavy on somebody could have to do with emotions let's see for Scorpio for Scorpio Scorpio this is for you it's coming towards Scorpio Cups is trying to pop out again. Yeah, somebody's very nervous about something. Like, somebody could be like, they're not sleeping well. They're really burdened by whatever this is. Scorpio. I don't want to take this. It looks more in reverse, so we'll just take it in reverse. Scorpio. Somebody might want to speak their truth. Looks like there's something about a change here too in the beginning. So you guys can be dealing with the Sagittarius, Gemini's here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. All right. So somebody has emotions here. It looks like there is something about maybe something was disappointing in the past, um, or something was just disappointing in general, and somebody. I think somebody's holding on to something. Maybe somebody was unreliable or maybe things weren't moving at all because maybe somebody was holding back. But it looks like somebody wants to take action. I think this could also be somebody that is holding on as well. Okay. There is strong emotions here. And there could be like a lot of passion between the two of you. This person could be very attractive. Some of you guys, this person could be your, your, your twin flame or soulmate. Or you can have a very strong connection with this person. Some of you guys can live with this person. Some of you guys. This person looks, it looks like this person's coming in. If you're waiting for this person, it looks like they're coming in. Something that you're not seeing though. What's that? Mm. There could be lack of communication, no communication, or maybe this person wants to win at all costs. So it looks like there's going to be a new cycle or something that's starting, okay? Some of you guys are dealing with the Capricorn or Cancer Pisces. There's a new cycle that's starting where something real is being offered. And it looks like it's being manifested or somebody's trying to make it happen. There could have been a lot of options, choices, or confusion. Maybe this person daydreams or you daydream about this person. Um, yeah, I'm getting a lot of like thinking about this person like a lot it's either you guys i think you guys maybe think about each other to be honest 
there could be also like a defensive energy or maybe somebody standing their ground or um yeah standing their ground somebody can be making some type of decision some of you guys are dealing with an emperor an emperor we have empress here but i'm getting a little bit of an emperor type energy So that somebody wants somebody has emotions here. I think somebody feels burdened because maybe there is a lot of confusion in terms of somebody's feelings. And I think it um maybe some of you guys it was very passionate too, but I think for some of you guys like um somebody could be like a little bit worried. Maybe about uh, maybe there's other people in the mix. Yeah, we have the lovers. The lovers could also represent like you know having more than one choice we have the seven of cups we have the three of pentacles the lovers um three of pentacles is here twice lovers is actually here twice as well we have lovers here and the three of pentacles here so i feel like there could be multiple people that is involved in the situation yeah six of pentacles somebody could be giving to multiple energies or their time is divided there could also be like an energy of maybe somebody feeling like they're not receiving enough but this could also be related to um uh the workplace for some of you guys maybe there is um maybe there is something about working together with people and maybe an energy of giving or something like that maybe somebody's losing hope with the star in reverse aquarius energy or maybe somebody is um I don't know if I, I almost want to say not ready to heal or maybe there's like a delay in maybe letting something go what's the lovers and the wheel the nine of pentacles speaking being independent single energy ace of swords something about clarity and truth and the queen of pentacles so we go from the nine of pentacles to the queen of pentacles maybe somebody's going to speak their truth about um their stability or maybe maybe th this has something to do with loyalty even so we have the seven of cups again but over here it's in reverse actually let me get one more for that queen of pentacles somebody could be holding on to somebody or there could be something about money maybe somebody watching their spending or something about money here What's this two cups? Somebody could be sad about something. There is a connection, but there's a sadness that's attached to it. Like somebody's disappointed in something. Maybe somebody made some type of decision. Maybe somebody's regretting something. Maybe somebody's weighing their options. Or somebody has a decision to make. nine of cups is here ace of wands is here but in reverse some of you guys could be dealing with something that maybe it's satisfying um but then it's like it's it's it, it it's not sustainable like it's an ace of wands like we have this ace of wands in reverse but then we also have this ace of pentacles that comes right after so i feel like you know maybe something was on and off on and off and maybe this ace of pentacles is something that's coming right right in that's more stable you also have this king of wands some of you guys there could have been a sexual thing the knight of wands <laughs> something that is in and out a lot of passion there's emotional fulfillment too some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign some of you guys there maybe this person was in and out but there is mutual love here maybe that i don't know there is something that happened in the past that somebody is regretting maybe somebody i don't know somebody's being judged for something that they did in the past and there's a decision that needs to be made or there's just something about the past and then somebody's making some type of decision weighing their options there is something about um this on and off energy where it's like very hot very passionate but it's it's not it doesn't last okay it was it was on and off maybe somebody had a family um maybe there's something about emotional fulfillment that's here as well okay. 
Ace of Pentacles is the Four of Wands. The Emperor. Remember I said I was getting Emperor energy. Somebody's going to want to come in and offer something real. Maybe some of you guys know this intuitively. Some of you guys... Um, some of you guys, there could be maybe an energy of keeping things quiet or keeping things to oneself. Okay, and what is the outcome for the situation? Seven of Pentacles, investing time and energy and effort into something. Somebody could be leaving something out in the cold, something that maybe was emotionally satisfying. Let's get one more. Somebody could have also ghosted and there was something about emotional satisfaction that was here. Or maybe somebody's overindulging. A lot of fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So if you guys can have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius um, in your moon rising or Venus, um, there, is a, there is a lot of chemistry here on a, on a physical level, okay? And I don't know, I think it's somebody that wants to invest time and energy and effort into something. Maybe some somebody was ghosted, but there is like emotional fulfillment or I don't know. Let me get one more for that, actually. Maybe somebody was being careless with something that there was emotional fulfillment there. A lot of passion, maybe sex for some of you. Lots. What is the, um, op the obstacle? obstacle is offering emotions or emotions could be the obstacles is keeping somebody in their head or having anxiety not sleeping well there's also perhaps a love triangle multiple people could be involved and offering something real and stable stability okay and what is the advice for the situation Ooh, why is this the advice there is heartbreak. Some of you guys could already be dealing with this heartbreak right now. I feel like there is a delay with, uh, could be an earth sign or a uh, air sign. I'll clear Super Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, somebody, some of you guys could have already emotionally detached or somebody could have walked away from the situation. Maybe somebody is, is going to get hurt. I'm not saying it's going to be you. And then we have this Ace of Cups. So there is emotional... There is emotions here. There is that heartbreak energy, which I feel like it could have already happened. Two of Cups is at the bottom of the deck. This Page of Swords and the King of Pentacles. This person's watching you, perhaps on social media. I think they're just feeling down. Maybe this person needs to feel their emotions and, and um, maybe that's what it is. This King of Pentacles, he could kind of come off as not really showing a lot of emotions. So uh, maybe this person just needs to observe or learn, even with this Page of Swords energy could be about learning so maybe this person just needs to learn um uh, and and really kind of like feel their feelings okay and maybe that's why we have this king of cups here so let's get you guys an oracle okay for scorpio Sorry guys, just need some space. Okay, for Scorpio. Scorpio, this is for you, what do they need to see? Masks, somebody is not tr showing their true self. Ooh, look, truth. You won't find out the truth though. You gonna find that truth out. Let's read it. Okay, so you guys got Goddess of Truth, Nundi. Nundi's guidance is get real. What is your truth? Truth telling matters. Being able to hear the truth matters just as much. Embodiment. Tell the truth. Each person has their own version. Speak yours. Words have impact. Remember that we all have triggers. Think before you speak and listen with compassion. Be gentle and stay calm in truth-telling conversations. Goddess declaration is the truth is my friend. I love that for you guys. And this is the Abiola, the Abiola Abrams African Goddess Rising Oracle deck. Okay? So, I'm going to leave that there for you guys. And thank you so much. Or hey, bye. Uh. <laughs>